Hi everyone. In this problem, um, we want to calculate the rate at which work is done by a person pushing a car at a constant speed. Remember that the speed of the car is constant, which means that the forces acting on the car is also uh, are balanced. Um, so let's start first by doing a free body diagram. We have the force, the pushing force acting to the right. You have the force of friction acting backwards. This is kinetic friction. The weight of the car acting vertically downwards. And this is the normal force acting vertically upwards. Now, because the car is moving at a constant speed, it means that the sum of forces on the car is zero. So the sum of forces along the x direction, so the sum of forces along the x direction implies that F minus FK will be equal to zero. In other words, F is equal to FK, where FK represents the kinetic friction acting on the car. Now, the sum of forces in the Y direction is equal to N minus MG. All of this will be equal to zero. This means that N is equal to MG. This defines the normal force acting on the car. Now, the good news is that by definition, the kinetic friction Fk is just going to be equal to mu k multiplied by n, which is equal to mu k mg. Remember, mu k is the coefficient of kinetic friction between the wheels of the tires and the road. <coughs> Sorry, between the wheels of the car and the road. Um, so what this all means is that this all implies that the force, the pushing force, is going to be equal to mu k mg, where mu k is the coefficient of friction between the wheels of the car and the road. So we have been asked to calculate the rate at which he is doing work, the rate at which he is doing work, pushing the car of mass M on a rough road at a constant speed. So the rate at do, of doing work, we call that power. So the average power P will be equal to the force that he asserts on the car multiplied by the velocity v. So this is going to be equal to mu mg multiplied by v. So the power transmitted is equal to mu mg v. This represents the rate at which he does work pushing the car forward. Now thank you everybody for your patience. Um, if you have any questions with regards to this problem, I will appreciate it if you ask in the discussion forum below this video. Thank you and remain blessed.